We're on Red Rock Road. Let's go. Let's go take a look. You want to come and sit right here, Papa? Come on, you can sit right here now. Oh, oh. Up at the front. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Look where I'm at. I'm in Galena, Missouri. And today I'm going to look at this place here. As you can see. So I'm going to tour this house because um, I might be interested in it. So let me take you through it. This is a, a little room for what they call a mud room. You can see the mud room. I'll show you from here. All right. And this is a kind of like a little small living room or dining room. You can see right here. Mm -hmm. And then it's got a breakfast nook, which is right here. This is where the breakfast nook is. Mm -hmm. See, there it is. And here's a here's one of the um, heaters to heat up. There's access outside to a little patio that's going to be that's going to be the entrance and look here's the living room I mean uh, the kitchen look at this nice size kitchen nice little living room here look at this uh, with another fireplace mm -hmm. you can see outside right there here's one of the bathrooms you can see all decorated here. And all nice. Look at that. Guess this would be the that would be for the guests. So let's go look down the hall now. So yeah, this is the kitchen right here. See? Stove, refrigerator, sink, counter. That's how you that's how we know. Let's go look over here. Look in the back here. Oh, look. It's kind of like a. Oh, this is the washroom. The washer and dryer. Wow, pretty good size here. Look at that. And we go back here into the dark. Here, let me turn the light on real quick. Not the best view, but there's something there. You see, this is called the canning room. This is where you do your canning. Oh, it's nice and cool, too. And then this is access to the garage. There you go. Look at that. Guys, I want to show you guys something. This is the garage. Mom. Hold on. We'll go over there and check it out right now. Whitey. Mmm. Whitey. Whitey. Wow, as you can see, that's pretty neat, though. Let's go upstairs. Well, access outside. There's another heater, but I'll I'll show you that in a minute. As we will get outside. Let's go look here. over here. Ah. This takes us upstairs. Wow! Look at that. Hey, so this is look at this room. A bedroom. One bedroom right here. Closet. Huh? Closet. You can see the outside right here. This is where I wow. saw you guys. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. And then here's another bedroom. The other side, and here's the outside over here. Here's another bedroom. Huh? Well, those, that's two bedrooms right there. Oh, look. Peach tree. What? Peach tree right here. That's a peach tree. And I run there who stick yeah, those nice stickers right there. Yeah, and look, we've got access to look at the oh, back from oh. here. Mama. Wow. Mama. Mm -hmm. Wow, pretty good size. Let's look over here. Hundreds. Oh, here's another bathroom. You can see. Let's see outside too here. Wow, look at that. Mm. 
Not bad. Pretty good. And look, here's another bedroom. Look at that. Wow. Mm. Let's go look right here. You can see down the road. Over there. Not bad. That's the third bedroom. And then here's another. This is kind of like a li another little living room area for the upstairs, you know, to kind of like watch TV or play games or whatever just before going to bed. All the bedrooms are that way. Or you have, um, how many was that? One, two, three bedrooms that way. And then it goes down the hall over here. Let's go look over here. Here's the stairs. That takes you down into the kitchen. And so we got another bedroom right here. You can see, look at that. Nice little bedroom. You can see the access outside there. This is uh, bedroom number four. And let's go down the hall here. And this is what they call the master bedroom. Of course, it needs to get painted, different color for sure. And there's access to the outside, which I was going to open it, but I'll, I'll leave it instead. But we're going to build a deck out here. A nice big size deck for this master bedroom. Here's this more view outside. You can see. Here's another bathroom. Of course, we're going to redo this whole bathroom. I don't know how, but we're going to. Fix the master bathroom, bathroom and might have to extend it outward that way. So, we'll see what we'll do with that. Um, yeah, the place does need a little touching up. You know, a little TLC, a little fixing. But... Nothing we can't handle and can't beat it for the price. It sits on uh, almost 18 acres. It goes way out there, you know, as I showed you earlier. Way out there. But anyway, I'll, um, I'll walk the outside and I'll give you guys a, a view of that. So let's, let's go check it out downstairs again. So yeah, that was coming downstairs, as you can see from the from the top, and then this is the kitchen right here. <laughs> see that? Not bad. All right. Let's go look at the outside. Huh? Wow! Look at this. So these are little. I guess screen porch or we'll if we get this place we'll probably tear this out and redo it Mama. and Mama. there's where the deck's gonna be for the master bedroom up there we're gonna kind of build it all the way around around here this front part and this will be the main entrance to the to the home we're gonna kind of fix all that up so yeah so it's not too bad you can see from the outside here give you a shot of it you can see look at that wow that looks pretty nice yeah that's a pretty big place and there's the road you can see there's the road comes down here and Technically, this was the dead end, but they made a, an easement down there so that some people can get around there that will be our neighbors down there. But yeah, this used to be the end of the road. But anyway, let me go show you some of the other buildings over here that they have that we're going to go see here. Garage. This is one of the garages. You can see. 
Let's go look over at the other one. That's considered a, another building there, kind of a garage thing. Uh, we'll probably stick the boat in there. Uh, or over here. But here's another building. Let's take a look at this. Wow, pretty nice sized building. Look at that. Yeah, this I guess used to be a, a barn for tractors and stuff like that. There's something over here. Let's go look. Oh. I guess there's the property line. Right there, there's neighbors. Okay, there's the property line, the fence right there. Okay, so the property literally runs behind that house there. Goes all the way down back there about another couple acres down that way. So technically the, the house next door was probably part of this property at one time and it was just separated from this property and from this house that's right over there, the one we're looking at. And so the land heads out that way. Heads out back out there. And out there approximately another, I would say at least a good 16 acres out there. So, yeah, we're gonna try to get on the other side to go see what's over there. There's a flat area out there. And we wanna go take a look at it to see if it'll work for what we what we want to do um, this land again it's almost 18 acres um, it uh, well, you can see it from over here like you can see the whole place there okay so let's go to the other side over there. I'm going to show you a little bit down here um, so anyway it's uh, approximately uh, almost 18 acres um, uh, it's not too bad. The ground is good for growing uh, crops and things. Um, as you can see, look. There's access over here. So, if everything goes good, which seems like it is, um, we're going to turn this into a little uh, a weekend getaway maybe. Or... You know farmers market or something you know I mean there's a lot of land here we might as well use it and well we want to share it with the community as well and uh, yeah and look we got logs here to work with already I mean yeah the place needs a little cleaning but uh, it'll get done and here's there is actually a road over there where you can get down in there down at the bottom of a holler. See, there's an actual road right here. As you can see, I'm going to take you through it. Let's go look. But yeah, look. As you can see, look, there's, there's a road. There's a little road that goes down there. See? I'd walk you down, but I'll take I'll do that in another video. But there's a road that goes all the way down and comes goes up on the other side. But like I said, I'll take you the next time. We'll go all the way to the other side. But let me show you this this uh, tree house. Look at this. They built this big tree house right here. Look at this. Huge thing. Look at the size of this. That was the size of another home. Of course, it might need to get torn down. Or who knows, we might repair it, I don't know. We'll do something with it. Look, they had goats, chickens, they had all kinds of stuff here. Let's go through. Looks like they had a chicken house right here. Yep. Chickens. Yeah, we're gonna got wire that we're gonna need. Got a bunch of big wood, but a lot of this stuff's gonna have to get cleared out and redone real nice. 
or just cleared out period but as you can see this is this is that place uh, there's a little road there on the other side of a fence as you can see right there you can see that road going right there that's the easement for the neighbors that are down the road there that I was talking about yeah anyway there's the house over there oh look some kind of a solar panel of some sort for something look at this oh imagine this is for an electric fence yeah. it's set up for an electric fence so we're gonna have an electric fence let's go look over here boy it's a lot of gnats but yeah look at this pretty neat huh all that stuff needs to get burned and cleaned out probably but yeah so anyway let's go back I'll just show you the house from here look at that it's a nice size place yeah so we're hoping that things go through hopefully like I said this is a 17 acres or almost 18 actually um, the reason why we we look into it it's because it's a uh, it's unrestricted land meaning uh, there's no restrictions here you're able to build you can put a business you can put pretty much anything you want you can do here there's not very many lands like that anymore uh, they're being scarce the more the more that people are realizing that most lands and properties well uh, uh, let me take that back all land in the United States is zoned for something. When you buy land, don't think you could just do whatever you want in it. You need to find out what it's zoned for. And if you're able to get a place like this that is unrestricted, that's what you're trying to get. A land that is unrestricted uh, where there's really basically no rules. And... Um, we're allowed to shoot our guns here. We're allowed to hunt here. We're allowed to put whatever it is that we want to put here. I mean, it's good sized land. The weather is really nice. I mean, right now we got a, a breeze going on, but it feels nice. And so, yeah. So we're looking into this place to see if uh, we're going to purchase it. So. Uh, I'll let you know. I'll keep you updated because uh, if we do a lot of videos will be coming from this location. So um, Bear with me. We'll see what happens and well We'll see uh, what the future holds So let's go inside One more time <laughs> 